Soma Stars. Welcome back to another edition of the Soma Scoop. We are here to bring you news on Fridays. Hi, I'm Carson. Hi, I'm Savannah. Now please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Right hand over your heart. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Today for lunch we'll be having pizza, salad, fruit, dessert, and a choice of milk. Breakfast on Monday will be sausage jugs, fruit cup, juice cup, and a choice of milk. Hey Soma Stars, guess what? What? The Harvest Festival is tomorrow at 11 to 3. Yay, I'm so excited. I'm going to be there at 8 in the morning to set up. Are you going? Yeah, I'll be there at 8 to set up too. Now, I'm ready to see my health tip of the week with Coach Brett and Ricky. Hi, Summer Stars. I'm Ricky, and I hear Coach Brett to give the health tip of the week. How's it going, Summer Stars? So for the health tip for the next few weeks, we're going to be focusing on good sportsmanship, and then we're going to be talking about some of the different rules of the playground. So they're going to be more of sports tips instead of health tips, but still the same concept. So. First, we're going to focus on good sportsmanship. So that's the key to playing any of these games that we're going to get into next week. So for good sportsmanship, there's four main factors of being a good sport and things you need to be focusing on when you're out here on the playground and showing good sportsmanship. Number one, you need to make sure you're following the rules of the game. You know the rules, you follow the rules. Number two, you need to make sure everyone's included. you got to make sure you let everyone play in the game. Don't tell people they can't play. Be a part of your game. Everyone gets to play. If anyone wants to join, you let them join. Number three, you need to be respectful to one another. You need to make sure you're saying positive things, being nice, supporting each other. You're not being mean, you're not making fun of people if they're not playing or not doing it correctly. You just need to support them and tell them how to show them how to do it correctly. And the fourth and last thing you need to do, make sure we're out here and try to have some fun. When we're at PE, we're at recess, we're at lunch, the point out here is to have fun. So if you can um, include everyone, be respectful, follow the rules, and have some fun. That's a great way to be a good sport and make sure that you're enjoying all of it. And like I said, starting next week, we're going to start going over the rules of some of the different games that we play out here at the playground during recess and lunch and PE to make sure everyone's on the same page and playing correctly so you guys can all play together and not be confused on what the proper rules are. And that's your health tip of the week. Thanks, Coach Brett and Ricky. Hey, Carson, are you giving wagon rides again this year? Maybe. I don't know if I'll be running away from kids the whole time. <laughs> cool. Anyways, now it's time for Soma's trivia. How can you save the environment? A. Watching YouTube all day. B. Eating pizza. C. Recycling. D. Doing absolutely nothing. Five, four, three, two, one. And the, and correct, the correct answer, answer is... C. Now here's Carrie with today's special day. Hi, Summer Stars. I'm Carrie, and today is National America Recycles Day. National America Recycles Day is celebrated on November 15th. Care Recycles Day was started in 1997 by the National Recycling Coalition and is declared each year by the pre Presidential Proclamation since 2009. This day has been a program called Keep America Beautiful. There are thousands of events that are happening across the United States to raise awareness about the importance of recycling and committing to recycling to, by buying products made from recycling recycled materials. I'm Carrie, now back to you in the studio. Thank you, Carrie. And now it's time for True or False, just to see if you were paying attention. National Recycling Day is celebrated on November 14th. This is false. National Recycling Day is celebrated on November 15th. Here's another one. National Recycling Day is a day to celebrate recycling and buying recyclable objects. This is true. And now a word from our sponsors. Are you ever late to class? Yes, all the time. Well, I have the perfect product for you. Introducing the teleportation hat. Wow, how does it work? I was just getting to that. First, you put on the hat, then you shout where you want to go. Be specific, or else you'll end up in the... Never mind. Nothing, value customer. Only $5. And 
$2 for shipping and handling. Of course, and here are some customers whose lives have been changed by the teleportation hat. So now I can go wherever I want in seconds for only five dollars. My house. <laughs> You can get the hat by calling 1-800-TELEPORTATION-HAT. You can also order the teleportation hat on teleportationhat.com. Disclaimer, we are not responsible for any motion sickness, side effects, or flatulence caused by the teleportation hat. Please do not call the number provided. Thank you. Have a nice day. This seems like a great product. I want to buy it right now. Yeah, it sure does, but I wonder if it actually works. Me too, but you never know until you buy it. Yeah, I guess you're right. Hey, do you know what the weather is today and tomorrow? No, but I know who does. Oh yeah, here's weatherman Ricky with the weather. Thanks, Savannah. Hey, summer stars. I'm weather. I'm weatherman Ricky. And whether you're ready or not, here's the weather. Today will be partly cloudy, with a high of 77 degrees and a low of 51 degrees. Hey, summer stars. Tomorrow is the harvest festival. There will be be a high of 82 degrees and a low of 59 degrees. I'm Weatherman Ricky, and now back to you in the studio. Thank you, Weatherman Ricky. Hey, Savannah, guess what time it is? Um, is it time for fifth period? No, Savannah, we're in our first period. Oh. Is it time for birthdays? Yes, how'd you know? Happy birthday to Lacey Ortiz. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. It's weird. Now for drum roll, please. So much fun facts. Yes, this is my favorite part of the day. Hey, mine too. Okay, did you know that in your own lifetime, you can produce enough saliva to fill two swimming pools? Hey, that's pretty cool, but pretty nasty if you ask me. Here's another one. A crocodile cannot stick its tongue out. So wait, crocodiles can't do this? But that's so easy. Yeah, it is for us, but not for them. Well, well, that's, that's all, all the time, time we, we have, have for today, today Summer Stars. And now it's time for the Soma School Pledge.